We all have memories, uh, some good, uh, unfortunately some bad. There are some days that we simply can't forget, again some good, some bad. January the 18th will always be one of those days. I still remember mid to late morning when I received a call that um, all was not well and if there was something I could do to check and I, and I asked my, my dear wife if she could rush across to Rickmansworth to where Komla was because I'd just been with him a few days earlier before coming back to Ghana and we shared so many deep thoughts about the future, about politics, about Ghana, about Africa, about the disenfranchised, uh, about how the world could change and how we could, how he could get involved in changing the world. He spoke about people, about presidents, president, past and future, and was of deep thought about how Ghana, in particular his beloved Ghana, our beloved Ghana, would develop. And uh, we invited a few friends around and a couple of people who had never met him before who wanted to meet him. So on that day when the message, it was surreal. And I remember my wife going through to Rickmansworth and uh, calling me and saying that my dear brother was no more. He had passed away and I dropped everything. It was a terrible, terrible, terrible moment in time. Since that time, it's impossible to forget January the 18th. Today, I've taken my time. I woke up early and I meditated, meditated, meditated just thinking a little bit. And um, going over the times that we spent together and the impact he made on others. Uh, it's rare that people make such impacts on so many people's lives, as Komla has done to young people in his industry and young people who just knew that he stood for something. He stood and had a level of integrity in terms of how he spoke and how he behaved and um, how he was perceived. And uh, I thank God that he will never be forgotten. He really will never be forgotten. And um, all I can say is that we say a little prayer for his soul and I know he's watching down on all of us and um, wishing us all the very, very, very best.